All right, guys, so here we have the Body Armor Outlet level three plate strapped into our rig, same rig we used for the level four plates. We're gonna do the same shooting, same calibers, and see if this thing will hold up to the 300 PRC, which I highly doubt, but it's gonna be cool to do it. So stay tuned, we're gonna get this done right now. All right, guys, 300 blackout, 110 grain VMAX, about 30 yards, level three plate, body armor outlet. We've got our camera down there, so I'm not gonna walk down in between just because I know it's gonna stop these, but we will do a follow-up at the end where we talk about the bulging, things like that. But let's get started, see what we can't do. All right, fire in the hole. Without a doubt. We didn't need that round. Let's see what we can do with the next caliber. All right, 62 grain, green tips, 5.56. Five, Let's see what this does. Without a doubt. Let's move on. All right, 6.8 SPC. Let's see what it does. I think it's time to step it up. Let's grab the uh, 458 SOCOM. And we're gonna hit it twice uh, with the 458 SOCOM. 550 grain, 458 SOCOM. Let's see what she does. I'm gonna hit it twice. One more time. Oh, she definitely rocked it, but I think we're still good. Let's take a walk down and see what it looks like. I have a lot of uh, trust in the fact that it stopped everything. I don't see any holes. Absolutely. Oh, uh, that one, well, it hit it good. Look at that. Let's see what the bulging on the back looks like. Actually, believe it or not, there is no deformation, but it did break our rig, as you can see. Um, but uh, yeah, it stopped every one of those, no doubt about it. So that's pretty awesome. Let's go grab the uh, 300 PRC and uh, see what we can do. All right, guys, so here we are, level three, 300 PRC, still the uh, Hornady match. 220 grains. Uh, I don't have high hopes for it uh, stopping it, but well, once again, you got to see what it does. I mean, honestly, it held up incredibly well to everything else we hit it with, uh, you know, and, and we'll talk more about that after this shot, but let's see what it does to this plate. Hit it low, Yeti. Matter of fact, let's go. Woo! All right, let's go down and see what it did. Let's see what it did, did. We do have to reinforce the rig for the next round of plates that we shoot, but so far, so good. Oh yeah, I can see the daylight right through the hole. That's a spicy meatball. Right through it. 
So, I mean, we don't expect that it was going to stop that, but you can see what all those rounds did to the... But uh, you can see, honestly, I mean, if you look, you can see all the hits. Uh, it looks like, I don't know if that's a crack. You nope, know, it's just a scrape. But uh, overall, I mean, <laughs> that thing really did a great job at stopping uh, all those other rounds. Rounds that are common. So I don't... Uh, I don't foresee this being uh, kind of an issue. As a matter of fact, if you look, there's not even any deformation on the back. Well, when you look at the back here, you see this ball, how, how low that is? Yeah. That means there was a ton more energy in that oh, bullet for sure. that went through. Without a doubt. If you come close, you can see it's yeah. just a star shape. And, uh, it almost looks like it drilled it out. Yeah. I mean, it, it's just that crazy of a round. And that, and that 300, or what's it, the 300 PRC? is very similar to the ballistics of the modern uh, rifles that the military is training right now. So when if they pick up that round, level three, you're hit. It'll, it'll go right through those plates. Probably level four, too. Yep, probably even level three and level four stacked. But, uh, you know, like I said, at the end of the day, um, you know, body armor is suggestive. It is to potentially save you from, from death. Uh, but not guaranteed. Um, and not only that, uh, I don't know anybody, uh, including the two gentlemen that I'm out with today, that would take a shot from any caliber on uh, body armor and think that at the end of the day, they're just going to walk away and it's not a big deal. Uh, it's not John Wick. Uh, you know, it's not Bruce Willis. Uh, this is real life stuff that uh, when you get hit, uh, you want to throw the white flag and say, that's it, I surrender, I'm done. So uh, it's there, uh, it could potentially save your life, um, but uh, at the end of the day, don't try to take a shot from uh, anything with body armor. Till next time, be good to each other, God bless, and special thanks to the Body Armor Outlet for supplying the armor today to be shot, and uh, we look forward to bringing you guys more from them real soon. Take care, bye-bye.